Greeting. Welcome to Psychic Medium, Tony Green. I'm Tony Green, and I will be doing a minimum of 30 minutes on YouTube this morning. Um, so those of you who normally join me on Blog Talk, ah, words, not always my friend. <laughs> Those of you who normally join me on Blog Talk, let me fix my camera here for YouTube because I'm cutting my own head off. Okay, those of you who normally join me on Blog Talk, there's some technical difficulties going on over there, and I can't get on. I can't get into the studio. So everything is going to be happening on YouTube this morning. So hey, welcome to the YouTube show. Um, just a few shout outs. This show will be airing live on WSCS and it will also be airing live on Rude Rangers TV and well, yes, podcasts too. So here we go. Hi, San Sandy Sanders. How are you? Um, hey, Genevieve. I hope you guys are having an absolutely amazing week. An amazing, I hope you had an amazing weekend. We are going to get into this right away. I'm going to be taking questions on YouTube. So if you have a question, just put it in the chat box. I will try to do my best to answer it today. Um, let's see. Sandy wants to know any messages that my... Nice angels or loved ones from the, uh, it would be great. Okay, so Sandy, do me a favor, narrow that down. Who do you want a message from? Um, if you have one specific loved one on the other side, just give me their name. I'll see what I can get. Um, although I already see people stepping in for you, I want to make sure I have the right people stepping in for you. Um Good morning. I'm going to lean in to read your name. T. T. Jan Roses one. Okay, whenever I read a name and I don't know it in the beginning, I go really slow with it. Like, and it's it's so sad. People would say, well, just get some glasses. I'm already wearing contacts. <laughs> so, but I can't like expand um make the um print bigger on um on here. So I'm just gonna call you Tija. Tija, is that good? Tija or Tija? Or can I just call you roses? Okay, so Sandy wants to know if I can connect with Ella. Yeah. Uh, so instantly my energy has become more serious. I feel like Sandy, this was a, a um, obviously it's a woman, it's an older woman. I'm going to tell you who I'm seeing. I don't know if who I'm seeing is who I'm, is who I'm channeling. But um, the person I'm seeing near the end, she was older, like a grandma, thinner. And she, um, I see her hair as being more, uh, not curly, but you know how back in the day they used to put the curlers in their hair. And she's in what we would call a house coat, but she didn't wear that unless she absolutely had to. Unless she had to. She liked to be up and about. Um, for the day. There's a Sandy, when she taps in, when I'm tapping into this person, there's like, I, the words I want to use and the words that she's using are completely different. So I'm going to tell you, I want to say seriousness. There's a seriousness to her. There's a seriousness to her energy. That's the word I want to use. The word she wants to use is there's a somberness. There's a somberness or a certain amount of sadness with her energy. Now, this isn't her sadness that she's in right now because where she is, it's peaceful, it's good, it's, you know, she's transitioned. 
This, now I want to say a few things. Um, this could have been how it was at the end for her. Like there was a certain amount of somberness at the end for her. And Sandy, if you can just confirm some of the things I'm saying, if this um, description matches Ella's or if the energy matches Ella, because there could be two people here for you. Okay, love. Um, she wants to say she loves you. She wants to say she misses. I want to say it's talking. She misses talking. This is my universal talking symbol, by the way, folks. And yes, I do this often. Um, Okay, in the okay, Sandy says the description, and I have to, you guys, if you're um, because we're on chat and blog talk is, you know, having technical difficulties. Um, this show airs on a number of TV shows where they do not see the chat; they just get to see all this right here. Um, so I'm going to read your comments when I'm asking questions and responding, just so everybody who's re-watching has an idea of the full conversation. So Sandy is saying the description matches, but the energy does not. So Sandy, what I'm gonna ask you is, in her very end, in her last week, and possibly, well, definitely right near the end, I'm hearing week or month, was there a somberness? Now, if this was not her energy, it was the people around her. This is a heaviness like, girl, I'm just saying, this is heavy. This is a really heavy energy. Um, but she misses, she misses, um, <laughs> God, I hope this is correct. Uh, okay, the people around her were very somber. That's the energy now. When I, I just, I'm going to take a minute and we have some time. So um, roses, just hold up. I'm going to try to get to you. I am going to get to you. I'm not going to try to, I'm going to. I'm, so if you have, uh, uh, just give me a second and let me, let me take care of Sandy. I'm going to explain as I go how things work for me because every psychic medium channel, intuitive card flipper, we all do it differently. We're all unique, and that's exactly how God meant us to be, okay? So when I get something like somber or heavy, it can be the way they felt. It could be the way the people around them felt, but it's supposed to be a confirmation. It's some, supposed to be something that lets you know I'm tapping in, tuning in, channeling in to the right person, okay? Um Hi, Radha. How are you? You may ask a question. Um, Roses gets to go next. Okay, so Sandy, she misses coffee. <laughs> she really misses coffee. And I feel like there was some kind of something she ate with the coffee, like a, a strudel. Not, I don't think it's a strudel, but it has that crumble on top. So like maybe a coffee cake. She really misses that. But she also misses like talking, talking, the communication, the the being able to say things and have people clearly hear her and respond to her because she's been trying to communicate with you a lot, Sandy. She's been trying to communicate with you a lot. She wants you to go into meditation with the exact intention. And I know, Sandy, your gifts are getting stronger. She wants you to go into the intention into meditation with the intention of connecting with her and just ask yes, no questions, okay? I am going to go to Rose's now. Rose's is asking, I know, I want to know if my angels or a family member. Okay, so Rose's, give me a specific, if you want to connect with a specific family member, please give me the name of the family member. Um, I just like to make sure I'm getting the right energy and the right person because sometimes when we say anybody, like, trust me, everybody shows up to the party. It's like a pay $5 at the door and you get to drink out the keg all night long, college party, okay? 
There's no peg up in here, by the way. It's just an example. Like if I say, if you say, who's here for me? People you don't even know, you never knew will show up. Some of them you'll be related to, like great, great, great uncles that you never even heard of. Other ones are like your grandpa's neighbor from like a hundred years ago. I don't know why it works like that for me, but it does. So a specific name is really helpful. Sandy, I hope that helped you with your day. Um, and I hope that helps you moving forward too. Uh, she's in your dreams all the time. Ella's in your dreams all the time, by the way, Sandy. Okay. Uh, Radha, you may ask a question. Uh, we knew it was coming. Um, I'm great. How are you? I'm great, Radha. Uh, I'm trying to read all the comments. I'm so sorry, everybody, but keep keep them coming. I'm going to try to... Um, Please, can I ask what your I will get married? Okay, Shiva, I have two people in front of you. Grandpa Cho Choi or Aunt Blanca. Okay, roses, here we go. I'm going to do roses, and then I'm going to go back to Raha, and then um, Shiva, you'll be after that. So please be patient with me. Please, please, please be patient with me um, as I try to navigate all the all the comments because they are coming in pretty quickly and I'm gonna to try to do everybody in line and not skip anybody. So, Radha, um, no, uh, yeah, wait, who am I? <laughs> Roses, Aunt Blanca is here. She, she just yelled at me. <laughs> Okay, I hope you guys crack up at this with me because this is the first time I'm doing all YouTube. Usually I just take callers on blog talk. Now I know why. Um, okay. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, yes, there's a... Th oh, my God. There's so many... So, okay. So, who? Roses, um, there's so much joy coming in with these two. Um, Blanca and Choi, Chu, C H U Y, they're here. And uh, uh, so the first thing that they want to say to you is you're doing better than you think you are. Keep going, don't stop. Um, you're going to have some light bulb moments coming in all this um, month. So for now, for a month, there's going to be tons of light bulb moments coming in. They're working um, like this, like this, like this, like this. They're coming in like this, like this, like this. Um, and then there was something like this with music for them, something I don't even know. Please know this is not me. I don't know what this is, but my this is like something with music like this for them, um, and they're letting you know. And it's like a na 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 na. I don't know. I'm not. Music is not one of my gifts, and they always make me use music, um, like like maraca or merengue music. I don't know what it is, but they're they're really bringing that through. That's a confirmation for you. The biggest thing they want you to know is that you are going to be having all these light bulb moments, like almost like um, new synapses are being created in your brain. Now, a synapsis is um, like a program, a belief, a new thought pattern. So when we, when we have a thought, um, the first time uh, a little connection, there's a dot and a dot and a connection is made in between it in our brain. If we never have that thought again, it fades away. The more we have that thought, the more, the, the more stronger, the stronger that synapsis, that connection, that belief that it, this, the stronger it becomes. And then the, the it becomes a, a belief and then a program. This is why they say, watch what you think, watch what you think, watch what you think, watch what you say to yourself about yourself. And they're really stressing this for you, Roses. They're really stressing that all of your thoughts. Oh my gosh. Okay. Whew. 
all of that to get to this. I'm so happy. Okay, so here we go. All of your thoughts, even those thoughts about yourself, are it's so important that you keep them up, up, up. And don't let them come down. <laughs> That's what they're saying. They're just saying it just like that. Keep them up, 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 and don't let them come down. Keep them in a, in that highest vibration. Only say things to you, about you, that you would uh, 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 say to the person that you love the most. Okay? Never say or have negative thoughts um about yourself for yourself because it creates that little synapsis and then it creates that program that turns into a belief now if this whether you're saying this about yourself you're believing it about other people that's that's one side of this the other side of this however is those that those synapses those beliefs and programs are created with every every thought that is repetitive like Oh my God, I don't have enough money. I'm not going to have enough money. I'm, I, how am I going to make it? Oh my gosh, I don't like this job. This is the worst job. Whatever it is that you're um, repeating to yourself, they really want you to work on your, your, uh, your self programming. So through the next month, the whole next month, there's going to be some things coming in that every time, um, just, just, I'm going to say just have really positive thoughts throughout the next month. They're saying allow yourself to go into that place where you create new thoughts. Uh, allow yourself to bring in really good, really new thoughts, better, better, uh, better programs. And you're going to have little moments where little things come in and then it's going to keep going. Okay. So. I hope that helped, Roses. I'm going to go back to Shiva now. Shiva, what is your, not Shiva, I'm sorry, you're next, Shiva. Radha, what was your, I'm looking for you on here. Um, Radha is asking, uh, I'm, I'm great, Radha. Uh, did you put a new question in here, Radha? Hi, Radha, what's your question, love? How can I help you today? And then next would be Shiva. Oh, Radha, you wanted to know also, um, you also wanted to know what year you're going to get married. Okay. Uh, Rudha. Rudha. Um, Is there anything unique and when? What I can tell you about the person you're going to marry is, um, okay, so this complete calmness came over my body when I tap into their energy. And I can tell you that this person is very enlightened and in touch with the stars. Not um, like Bollywood or Hollywood stars, but the universal stars. This person has enlightenment beyond... Um, this person has a very strong enlightenment. This person has a very strong... energetic field, a very capable energetic field. This person is going to teach you how to connect with the universe and divinity. This person is going to teach you. And when I use this word, understand I'm using it in a positive context, how to manipulate the energy and the world to be in alignment with the world you are supposed to be creating. It's very amazing to even play in this person's energy right now because this is the energy that worlds are created in. And it's like they're showing me like the movements with the hands, but that's really not it. It's this knowing, this energy, this place, this being. So, Rudha, Radha, 
I want to tell you that when this person comes in, you will just being in this person's energy will help you to excel or um, that word that means uh, evolve to evolve, but then you will learn a great deal. It is going to tame you. It is going to tame you, but it is going to um, bring you into oneness. If, if you allow it to, if you allow it to, okay? If you allow it to. Okay, Shiva was next. Shiva, if you have a question, please re-enter your question. Thank you. Thank you, uh, Rud Rudha. Is it Rud, Rud R-U-D-H-A, or Rud Rudha? Um, let me see if I can find Shiva's question on here. Um Yes, I instantly get a, a, a yes, Shivai, Shivai or Shiva, Shivai. Um, you are going to get married. It's going to happen very quickly. As a matter of fact, it will happen so quickly. Some people may not agree with, um, with it because it is happening so quickly. Uh, but there's nothing anybody will be able to say to you. All logic will escape you when you meet this person. It's almost like you want to run away and escape with this person. It's a choice you all have to make. It's something you're going to have to decide when that time comes. Who? Uh, so please know that um, it's better sometimes to take your time. But if you know, you know, right? If both of you know, you know. Okay, let me go down. Bumblebee. Hi, I like that name. Hey there. Do my guides have a message for me regarding marriage? Thank you. Um, okay, Bumble. I believe it's Bumblebee. Um, Everybody wants to know about marriage. Oh, my goodness. Relationships and marriage. Ah, uh, Bumblebee. Uh, do your guides. You know, your guides, I'm going to tell you what is important. I'm going to come back to you. I'm going to come back because if I'm not getting something very strong from the get-go, I don't try to push it. Hmm. I'm going to come back to you because I'm not going to try to force a message, but I will come back to you and see what they have to say um, before I get off of this. Uh, you're welcome, Sandy. Um, Loretta, narrow it down. I don't do that. Is there anyone around? Like I said earlier, um, if you ask that, you're going to get, you know, like a college frat party. Nobody knows anybody, but everybody was there. So uh, let me, um, let me, uh, uh, Loretta, please narrow that down for me. Um, and th by the way, folks, by the way, there are always people around us, always. Our loved ones are always around us. Our angels are always around us. Ascended masters are always around us. They are always with us. They never leave us alone. That's why I always feel like somebody's watching me. Yeah. Okay. So that was not probably as funny as I think it was. Because <laughs> uh, somebody is always watching us. Okay. Uh, uh, do you feel I'll meet him? Uh, Bumblebee, sure, no worries, XX. Uh, okay. Rinda, uh, please, can I ask you if I will settle outside of my current country after I get married? N oh, instantly I hear a no on after you get married. Um, however... I, this might sound weird. I don't know. I don't know if it, I can, and remember time is fluid. 
Time is fluid. I do feel like you are going to settle outside of your country, but it might even be before you get married. Um, be open to timelines and the way things happen for you. Um, don't be stuck on everything has to work in this order. Allow the universe to come in and have it happen in the best way for you. Okay. And you will be very, very, very happy with how things happen. If you kind of go with the flow, even if it's not what you thought it would be allowing it to happen, however it happens. And remember, I might be hearing before you're married, but it might be right at that time when like right at that time, I do feel like you are going to settle outside of your, your country though. I do feel like that. Okay. Uh, Bumblebee, I'm going to go back to your question. I'm going to scroll back up. Okay. Here's a, okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Here's the thing. They don't have a message about marriage for you, but they do have a message about career and or work for you. And what they're saying is you need to, uh, that's why I wasn't getting it earlier because I was like marriage, 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 marriage. And they were like, boom, like, like a flat line. They're like, we're not going there today um, because that is not the most important thing you should be focused on right now. The most important thing you should be focused on right now is work and career. And they're saying, and if I'm getting this wrong, if this is somebody else's energy that is on the chat or listening, please let me know. But I'm going to tell you the biggest thing they're saying is that you should be focused on your career. And there's something you've been wanting to do off on your own, out on your own. And they want you to start, if you're already off on your own, if you already have a business on your own or you're doing something on the side on your own, they're saying it's going to escalate and really focus in on that. You need to be ready for that because it's going to, and when they say escalate, like elevate is straight up, escalate is step, 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 a steady inclination. They're saying it's going to escalate. You're going to be escalating up very soon. You're going to have forward movement trajectory. If you are not on your own, doing something on your own right now, career rise, you have an idea of it. It's coming in. All the pieces are falling into place and you need to get on that. You need to get on that. You need to get on that. Now, this doesn't mean, and let me stress this for you. If you have a day job, it doesn't mean quit your day, day job, get rid of all your security and your, your benefits and your, your, your insurance. It means strategically plan and make the, take those steps, make those moves to start implementing. Some of the biggest businesses started as a side project. Okay, for you, for you, for you. Now, every show I do a clearing today's show is going to be unconditional love for self and others. But really quick. Um, yep, that's what I'm going to do. Um, unconditionally love ourselves. And others. Okay, clear that. We're going to clear this. And, it, you know, if you want to come back and just get the clearing until you feel that unconditional love for self, you can do that. It's at about the 28 minute mark. Okay, for everybody listening, watching, and chatted who came in, thank you so much. I love you guys so much.